my beautiful people and welcome back to the channel. Am I on the internet with no makeup on, with a face full of spots? Yes. Am I self-conscious about it? A little bit, a little bit. But let's, we've addressed the elephant in the room. Let's go on with the video. So today, um, well, last night I went on a night out and the next, it's the day after. It's the morning after the night before. I need to do a clean with me. I need to clean up my room. It is, I'm a little bit embarrassed to share, but it's disgusting. So this is gonna be the before, and then we'll do an after. It's gonna be a lot better. Um, but it's like a deep clean, like I really wanna do, sorry, it felt really close then. I really wanna do like a really thorough deep clean. Um, also I have fake tan here. It's a whole thing, it's a whole thing. Also tonight, Luke is coming down and we are discussing having a barbecue. The first barbecue of 2022, 2022. First barbecue of 2022, oh my God, can you tell I'm not here? I'm not in the room. It is time to tackle this room. So, I'm a little bit scared to show you. Okay, prepare yourself for what you're about to see. This is my room right now. This is the current state of affairs. I have clothes on the door, clothes over there that I haven't put away. This is um, an O Poly order. So subscribe to see that. I'm gonna do a haul. Um, I obviously straightened my hair last night and got all my hair stuff out and I haven't cleaned it away. The fake tan is out. I mean, this whole area is just disgusting shoes are out i want to like pull all this out hoover clean behind it um these are christmas presents that i still haven't put away it's it's just a whole thing this is my outfit of the day it's it's just not a vibe let's be honest some like baggy joggers and good old tala um then as you go like further round, this pile of clothes here a shambles um, up here, I really want to change all this. I just feel like it's getting a collection of like mess. I do also want to, I mean, look, this is just disgusting. Um, and over here, look at all the stack of like, it's just gross. But here, um, it's been like this for a while and I, I just want to refresh, a massive refresh. The door, everything needs to come off and it needs to get sorted out. So, if clean with me time lapses are something that you enjoy, then this is definitely gonna be the one for you. I don't even know where to start. Let's go! Woo! <laughs> right, I've just been cleaning and this is like a really random fact useful tip so i've been getting estrid razors now for a year like a, a long time anyway you get loads so the razors come in like these little plastic things and what i've found is i've got loads of them left over because obviously you use the razor you throw the razor away when it doesn't work anymore or it's too blunt these seem too handy to throw away so i now keep my necklaces in them so they're really good for like travel so your necklaces don't get like all tangled up so there's a little tip for you and they actually fit really nicely this is like a stackers um oh, what are they called jewelry box and they fit really conveniently all along there so like you can see i used to store them in these like bags when you get a spare button on like a blazer or a skirt or whatever they come in these but they're all different sizes they don't look very nice so well you can see i've been like collecting them and then putting my necklaces in them and they stack really nicely in here so you can see you can like get four really conveniently <laughs> next to each other two random things but like really aesthetically bit together i just thought that was a little hack for you to stop your jewelry from getting tangled you don't obviously have to keep it in there you can just keep you could just keep like your jewelry and have loads of these just like in a drawer or something and stop them from getting tangled so just thought i'd mention <laughs> I've got 
to show you guys this. This is actually vile. This is so gross. I don't actually know why I'm showing you it. But I've just pulled this out. Look at that dust. Ugh! Disgusting. Disgusting! And that, ladies and gentlemen, is why I am cleaning. Because... That's... That's vile. <laughs> I have a box hoarding problem. I have so many shoe boxes, empty boxes, even makeup, like the packaging from a, a MAC foundation. Why am I like this? Is anybody else like this? I have so many boxes. It's a joke. The next thing is these mirrors. I need a good clean. This is probably not the best shot because you're literally going to look at my thumb, but we move. Okay, so this bit now is looking cleaner. This bit now is looking cleaner. I've made like a little decorative thing here. Obviously without the cleaning stuff. It's like backwards, but without this, this is really cool. This is like an incense um, thing. So you put like an incense in there and like all the smoke comes out of the top of the funnel. I'm not too sure where to put it, but we move. Now I think it is time to tackle the clothes. Look at that over there and the huge pile. It's gonna be a really big job. Keep powering, keep plowing through. just saw I've like separated them out into categories so I've got like pajamas jumpers trousers um, and basically now I'm gonna take out something from the drawer that's the same size that it needs to be and fold it it's basically Marie Kondo if you know Marie Kondo that's basically how I fold all my stuff so when you open my drawers you can see everything you can see it all but um, yeah they may look full but um, basically all my, all my clothes are in these piles. So I need to get on and start folding.
for a little comfort break. Got a nice little bacon roll with a bit of avocado. A little coffee. Local Birds Bakery made this, um, I think, for Ukraine, for the war that's going on, to like help with the support, which is nice. But two in one. Helping out and eating a cake. What could be better? We are back. Um, I sat outside and even though it's really quite nice and sunny outside, um, it is very windy. So this barbecue, we might be a bit cold. But while I was, God, look at my hair. While I was waiting, eating, while we were all sat outside, I had a very exciting, check I'm not like showing my details, a very exciting order from Tala. This is their new Dayflex range. I'm so excited. I'm so excited. I've never ordered, obviously it's a new range and I tried to order them on their first drop and it sold out in like three minutes apparently, which is ridiculous. Um, but I was lucky and on the second drop I got it. I got what I wanted. Woo! So apparently Tala now comes in plastic bags which it never used to come in before. I wonder why they've done that. Maybe things are getting arrived damaged. And here we are. Whoa. What are these? Okay so we have some how exciting. This lighting's terrible. Um, we'll, we'll work with it, it's fine. But the tags are still plant, um, so you can plant them, which I think is really cool. But they also say this now, which I quite like. Um, but here it, they are, they look tiny. Um, they have this like, I guess that's probably why, they have this wrap waist. You can't really, oh, there you go. So they have like a wrap waist at the top and then they have this I think they said there was a pocket on them. Oh, it's not not really a pocket. Oh, oh no, okay, it's bigger than, I mean, you're not getting a lot in it, but there is a little pocket here. It's just like a, a slit in the top of the seam. Um, it says taller on the back. Very nice material, like, oh, just like gym material, really, like, like a legging, but very different to the core, which is actually here. Obviously these are the core, uh, I think they're called zinnia, but I can't remember. But look at the difference, like these, the stretching to this, it's more, I don't know, it's weird, it's a weird material, it's, it's lycra -y. it's very like a lycra. Anyway, so I got the leggings, I also got the mock neck, I think they call it, so it's like a high neck and it has like finger holes which I thought was quite cool, um, you see? So I got that as the top, and then I also got this, which I fell in love with. Ta-da! I'm showing this really weirdly, but this is the um, wrap sports bra. But I am not gonna wear this as a sports bra because there is no support, but I'll just wear this as like a little cute top on like holidays with shorts and stuff like that. I think it's really cute. Or as actually, you know, a bra. And then it just says Tala at the bottom, just there. And I got this in the khaki instead of the black because I thought it was a bit more, a bit different. So yeah, that came while I was waiting, which is really, nice and i am very tempted to try it on and just wear it today i think i'm gonna finish this last pile and then i might put it on it's here i might put it on to see what it's like hello yeah i've put some makeup on i've made a bit of an effort so i just thought i would do a quick talk through of the new tala stuff that i got and show you it's on and then we'll do like a full room um after because i've done it before i have patchy fake tan don't at me i'm aware we'll just move past it but this is the wrap bra obviously it's a taller here and it's in this lovely khaki color i 100 percent understand what everyone was saying when they were like it's a free boob job because my boobs don't look like this <laughs> they don't i'm like a little bit conscious i'm like anyway that's those i also got this 
and these are obviously the wrap leggings actually i'll show you the top they are quite high like they do come up quite high um obviously you can see the wrap detail here at the front i think and then at the back is obviously where it says Tala, but they do come up really quite high and then this is the mock neck top i will say the material is very like nice <laughs> the material is so like creamy and i get what people are saying when they say it feels like nothing's on because it does feel just so soft and second skin like um obviously you've got the hand things um the arms are always really long on me i always I must have short arms so this is the full outfit obviously if you want you could probably make them join up um and then this is the back obviously it says tala and tala really nice length as well not too long i am five foot two and a half two three um so yeah not stupidly long though there is definitely a bit of room in here if you were taller than me um but so comfy anyway right now i've done that completely random little taller section of the video um if you'll notice i'm trying to grow my fringe and i'm in that like really awkward stage where it's not long enough to go behind my ears but it's not short enough to be a fringe right i need to go to tesco and get some food so this is for the barbecue I said this earlier, but this is for the barbecue, so let's go. I just thought, I was, I've just done the whole like, let's go to Tesco, and I haven't shown you the finished product, the finished outcome of me tidying all day. Obviously, we started here. All of the things have been removed from the door. Um, you go in, and I, like I said, created this like, cute little i don't know if i've got too much on it but i've got this which has just got like some crystals an empty perfume um like a vase which i don't have anything in the head one and then my fake flowers um obviously my print wall exactly the same but all of this is now empty this is just my camera charger which i will move and these are my crocs which i am wearing all of here is clean the mirror is a lot more clean you actually see what i look like in the mirror and you can see the whole area the floor is all nice and clean and hoovered that was over there um but the plan is to get rid of it i just don't want to get rid of it today so it's there for now. My poor bin with the big dent in the side of it. I, I, I should probably invest in a new bin. Um, but all of this is clear. My bed, semi-made. That's my makeup bag. I will move that. Change the angle to here. You can see that I... I think I... I mean, that wasn't that messy, but I tidied that. Obviously, my fireplace. The flowers, obviously, are over here now. And um, I just kind of changed it up a little bit. These are some of my Morton Brown perfumes and I just keep them in the box because I think the light can affect them. I know I've got that one over there which is the um, Chanel one but it's completely empty now whereas obviously these actually have perfumes in so didn't like that. This is just a candle which really perfectly matches the wall. What my telly section looks like, I think it's just so much clearer, it's so much nicer. Um, obviously I still have, you can't really see it, still have the um, flowers, <laughs> English language lost me then, still have the vase and the flowers and then obviously the glass that side, but I just think that looks so much neater, slicker, whatever, you can actually watch the TV now, not that I watch it that often, but if I want to it's there. Um, the, this is the one thing that I wanted to change but didn't actually get round to, but I'm sick of cleaning today, so this is a task for another day. And then the final thing is here. Obviously, this was full of clothes. The stool is empty of clothes, um, and this is just an O Poly order, which, like I said earlier, will be coming to the channel, and I just need to decide which ones I want to keep which I think are these ones, and then I'll send back any that I don't. So yeah, that is the full before and after done. And now let's go to Tesco. go 
we've got all the stuff just there. I'm driving around the car park, so don't worry. Actually, I actually need to put my lights on. Um, so yes, going home now. Obviously, Lucas is here. So um, yeah, gonna go home and start cooking. See you when we get home. Also, look at that. <laughs> I went for a car MOT and they gave me a free one. Oh my God, my lucky day. <laughs> it's all going on. The burgers are on. Um, with this, we've got the pi pickles, gherkins. 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 Gherkin. You're making some like burger sauce with ketchup and mustard. Luke's buns, my buns, and Ooh. chips, which are, I think they're done. I think the chips are done. So yeah, this is where we're at, and I'll show you the finished results. And there we have it, the finished results. I've got a prawn burger and a plant-based burger. And these are our chips that Lucas put seasoning on and made them so good. They're so nice. So that's it. I'm going to sign off here, guys, because all I'm going to end up doing is eating those burgers, chilling out. So I might as well end the vlog here. I hope you enjoyed this video. It is a bit of a different one for me. I've obviously never done a cleaning video on this channel, if you liked it. As always, please leave me a like down below and subscribe if you haven't already. I'll see you next week for another video. Bye for now. Mm -hmm.